vanquishing Nana, the patron deity of the lost city of Ur. To win the adventure is not the only time in Ghost of Ur that an adventurer from 3800 BC can come in contact with the great deities of ancient Sumer, Misawa, the goddess of wisdom and Emmer, Gilgamesh, the greatest of all Sumerians, and Majestic Inki, the flood bringer and science deliverer. All are ever present and waiting to either help or hinder a would-be hero. Let's take a look at what they do in Ghost of Ur. First, Misawa on Emmer Field, Gilgamesh on Desert Tile, and Inki on Water Tile, when discovered or visited, can be rolled against once per turn with them gaining a plus 25 to their defender roll. If the adventurer is unsuccessful on their combat roll, the adventurer does not have to enter retreat and simply goes about the rest of their turn as normal. If successful, the adventurer receives a Nisiyama card and is immediately teleported to any exposed tile that is, Emmer Field for Nisaba, Desert for Gilgamesh, or Water for Inki of their choosing, including the current tile, thus ending their turn and sacrificing any next turn from a roll of two that they may have had that round. Be very careful, adventurers. While the ghosts of Ur can help at times, they can be your worst enemy at others. See you in Ancient Sumer, Spring of 22 Kickstarter.